always looks oh, great. Alright, we're gonna make really a nice story for the next year. Yeah, so I'll just read out the new stuff on it, but they wish to remain uncredited, so there's it. Like, I'm currently on the like, like, I like, I like, I like, I the program I used to where I can see the profile See him, I can just clap them right back into the damn. Excess overlay does that too, but I'm not really sure how it differs. What's just the version I use? Welcome back to the entire now I can hear. I swear to God, I will kill you. I am going to test to get an internship. Yes, sir. I don't know. I don't know what he said there. We're gonna be by this corner. Huh? Yes. Y yes, what? Don't act. Don't stutter. You're fine. No, I just don't. Actually, um, what's fine? Um, I'm curious. I don't think I literally have everything but the avatars turned off. Five minutes, they're bone moving jelly. Jack, yeah, but you're not now. Jack, yeah, congratulations. I can get you later. Yeah, I hope so. I feel like I'm not making that point. I can't feel as intensely as you see. I think I like to take some time to name my arms. I'm thinking it's not. It's a classic yeah, for today's tour. Like the tour thing. So, you know, uh, it's like an interactive story. Now we know what we like And for like two to three hours, it's going to take us through the toll as grand adventure. And also, like, you know, doing voice and and uh, I we know But we should be starting now. No, it's not. You. It's seven thirty. Everyone will be flocking in. I know, but you haven't been here in a while. It usually takes like ten, four, seven thirty-five to seven forty. Unless they're trying to be on time. But yeah, let's go. Just the only problem is Oscar relies on being late. Yeah, she needs yeah. to fill because that is weekend. very dependent on performance of yeah, everyone. Um, no, yeah, it's so hard. I just feel like uh, if you like one minute late, one person yeah. just records yeah. it, 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 it screws it up for everybody. So like, I mean, I mean, look, it's kind of hard. I, I would want to think that the mermaid teams are actually oh, wait, the, the, the gateway to the the, the oh, good I'm ending. The part is the main. I mean, they're like the link to me. But I can't be certain because there's no way for us to get them. Mm. It seems and like we rarely ever get one. If we're going to get the test on a tour. Damn, that was cool. Yeah, 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 how are we? How is that going to last the tour? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
What the heck is over here? I've, I've got screamy boys. Hey, 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 mother travelers, kid goes your attention. Oh shit, it's the thrill king again. Is about to begin. Pong. Kindly, oh, okay. Pong. Make your way to the prep room. I repeat. Yeah, let me, let me, let me, kindly, me, make your way room. to the prep room. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, you man of culture. Hmm. Yeah, I don't feel like I. Oh, it's a fight over here. Dun, 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 if your daughter has it, then you would blast me out of existence, please. I wonder if she'll gain, like, full control of her ether powers, but if the mother dies, she might, like, go nuts and become an ether demon. I have no idea. I'm I'm gold up crap, to to is is Lucian not here? Uh, world the way, I haven't like seen that spell. creature fucking everywhere here. What is it? What is it? It's scrolled in the next world. Yep. Damn, what a shame Steve Jobs came down with Lizzie. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> no, there's no Sleazy anymore. <laughs> 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 Stop moving. Let me read it. Let me read it. Is there any more artifacts back there? problem. You're almost What's good? I'm a space mom. I'm not inclined to talk to anyone right now. I require a land. I know, I know, I know. I like. How's it going, dude? I can. I was gonna do it myself, but then. Yo, Nekus. Yeah, I was about to say, I was about to do it myself, but then Nekus. Man, I had a lot of money. I had a lot of time, and I'm like. The tree or the Nekus at the end? Ooh, Hello, Carol. You're watching with intent. Don't worry. I won't fail you in this performance. I worry more about myself right now. I get the feeling that I will disappear every first second. Down here. Oh. The feeling oh, is yeah. mutual. Mm. Yeah, like now, like literally, I time out all the three minutes right now. It's it's so annoying. And I last time I was here, it wasn't so bad. It's just sometimes my VR headset has days where it says "fuck you, green guy." And, uh, you're not going to do that shit today. Yo, yo, wait, Moist, wait, Moist, Minis, Minis, don't go. You're blocking me, soldier. Come on, man. No, we got Mitsu, we got Mitsu, we got Mitsu, and we got, we got the no. ice thing from, from, from Ben Zen. Oh, so now walking over to the- I can silence people with oh, Okay, okay, yeah, we're good, we're good. Um... Ah, yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay, Nine. we're good. <laughs> Eight. We're good. Seven. What? Six. Six. Wait, Six. Wait, Five. Four. Three. Two. And they said okay. Wait, sh Dearest travelers, uh, I invited Art Fantasy to Discord server. Boy, shut up. I kindly yeah, ask you your attention. The event of tonight will now begin. Apologies for interrupting, my dear friends. Don't worry, this will be worth it. It seems you've met with an uncertain fate. Oh. You find yourself at an interdimensional crossroads, a rendezvous of travelers between worlds. Please, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Sheen of VR Travelers. And I 
will be your tour guide through this story. Welcome to the Rendezvous, our point of contact to the narrative domains below. You are welcome to stream and or record our events. This is a story-based tour, and as with any tour in the real world, we kindly ask that you remain silent during narration. However, it is absolutely imperative you do talk as we walk. As planning and working together with your friends is the only way to save them. My friends, oh. at this time, I recommend that you go to your safety and performance settings to advance graphics and lower the quality to prevent any lagging you are experiencing to the number of people in this world. Set your anti-aliasing to off. Yes, sir. Will do. If you are still yeah. experiencing lag after doing that, I recommend you turn off avatars for everyone except myself, your tour guide, and my fellow tour guides standing next to me. Where are they? There they are. I think you're good to go. Trey Jim and Rendizo. You're good to go. You'll see them soon. My friends, I will now open a portal to the world of the pilot. Ooh. A terrible story. A place of suffering. So far, until all of you can intervene in a meaningful way. For those of you standing in front of me, kindly move aside. I will now, now drop a portal. You made it. God damn it, the voices are so freaking cool. I need by accident. It's a shifting cube. Where's the front? Yeah. Wait, wait, what's <laughs> that, that's a good question. Where is the front? Where's the back? What's caving in? Is the front? It is Ant Panda. I know you kept it. It's Ant Panda. I said it once and it's my friends. My friends. This is an invite plus instance. And I recommend that you add someone else here as a friend to get back in should you crash. I repeat, I this will be an invite plus invite. You can add me, and the only way back to you is to send an invite. I'll invite you back, I promise. You are welcome to send an invite request to me or my fellow tour guides. I got you, Sherrod. I got you, baby. I have a child hiding between the portal. I got you, D-boy. I got you, baby. Please wait for it to stabilize. Wait. Wait. Wait for it. Wait. Wait. It's oh, gone. Oh, it's oh, it's it's breath. Breath. That actually yeah, again. Cool. Just a moment. Don't go in the portal. Wait for it to stabilize, please. I don't see a portal. Oh. Oh, there it is. I'm oh, doing good so far. Wait. How about Has you? it stabilized? Wait, wait, it appears wait. to be stable. My friends, first. enter. Onward, friends. Hey, we oh, fire. Oh. On the way through the right, everyone, oh, everyone, 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 everyone get in. So we're going. No, we're I don't have any arms. Oh, yeah, I'm still over the lap. Yes. Welcome to the Twilight Zone. He's, he's too tired from yesterday. So I'm... Being the ancient evil survives. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. I can hear you when I'm making it out. I mean, like when I'm making clips, uh, you know what I'm saying? When I'm making clips, it doesn't show up in the. Oh, yeah. Convince Chesha to finally go on the tour. 
Hmm. Yeah, you need to you need to set your mic. Hey, you keep trying. Hey, oh, yeah. Yeah. Anyways, okay. no, he's to that? he's coming. Yo yo yo, oh, welcome, welcome, welcome. Yes, okay. I'm in the car. He's over there. Across the way. Need to bring a sexual talk. Yeah, somebody's coming. Wait, who's the guy who's the big chill out? I'm so sorry, you have a dirty mind. Please. Luna, in case you're wondering, Cheshire's all the way under the sun. I think. Might have wasted. Is this a D's nuts joke? <laughs> I'm amazing. Oh, no, 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 no. Damn, you said you come in contact with D's. Enough. Hmm. It doesn't... I'm actually pretty excited because last time I was at this tour, I wasn't able to attend it from the beginning. Well, you're in for a treat. Well, oh. okay, we have to get a weapon. We must get a weapon this time. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Let us see what information we can gather this time. How big is it? My friends, gather around where you can hear me clearly. I repeat, my friends, travelers, gather around where you can hear me clearly. Welcome to the domain of Pilot. This terrible place waits for you. My friends, please, at this time, make sure your world music is turned way up to where you can clearly hear the wind. Feel free to lower it a bit as we move on. But keep in mind, music is an important part of the tour. Now then, enough talk. It is time to begin this tale. It is time to begin an event that all of you will remember forever. Everyone, click. On the yellow save point behind me. I'm getting some more uh, invites from this place, dude. Yo, this edible oh, is the same. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Benefits like to the uh, model that has a much more fitting aesthetic for this world. Hey, throw. Does yeah, anybody have a single bite? Feels really like a big old night. I want good Between the forest and the countryside, there sits a lone house, and in this lone house is a young girl. Every evening, she looks out her bedroom window, and her imagination soars. She wonders about the faraway exotic places her father always tells her about. She closes her eyes, and she can see them. Beautiful cities filled with waterfalls and white birds. Majestic mountains capped by clouds so soft one could fall asleep on them. She wonders, and she wonders, until the sun sets, and the crickets fill the air. In her mind, the scene shifts to the front door. She pictures her father finally coming home. She hopes for it with all her heart. It's going to be tonight. She knows it is. Her heart flutters as she opens her eyes expectantly. The sky is purple, and the path outside is empty. She was wrong. He hasn't come home. She shoves the curtains across and turns from the window. My friends, let's go inside and see if she's all right. This way. I obey. Oh, sweet. Oh, shit. <laughs> Yay, let's Yo, go. Yo, 
Wait, my children, I have returned from my five-year journey with is the milk. Is it okay? Have you got any milk? Bro, I like seeing <laughs> come back fucking the milk. Yeah, okay. James May. Bro, James like help. Holy Cole, Where's the milk? Characters. What? Oh, it's kind of funny. Give me the milkies. I, man, like, I want milkies. Dad I'm sorry, for I can't you. Ten years ago. I am standing up right now. Hold up. This is the most fun thing to do. I want milkies. I'm not talking about milkies. Roll here. What's up? I've been turned into a little hell. Shut up. Thank you, friends. The young girl trudges through the dark house. The kitchen is empty. Her mother has forgotten to cook again. The girl grabs an apple from the table, pulls up a chair, and eats alone. She closes her eyes again, wanting to go to another place. The image slowly forms in her mind. Wisp of mist brushing by. The gentle rush of cool air in her ears. The deep thrum as she pisses her clouds. The land far below her. Everything cast in a radiant golden light. Then the sky knocks. No, not the sky. She opens her eyes. Could it be? The chair clatters to the ground and she runs toward the front door. She can't contain her excitement. There he is. He is finally home. She lets out a cry of joy and a bit of sadness. And her father picks her up and holds her tightly. <laughs> is Mama still sleeping by the radar? Papa's voice is deep and comforting, like the cloud she flew through. Only when you're gone so long. Her mother's voice drifts in, warming the room. She joins them in a tight embrace. I'll always come back, he says. He takes out a sealed bottle of capsules from his jacket and hands it to the mother. He apologizes for only being able to get enough for ten months. He seems really sad about it. Excuse me, Dreja. Don't worry, the mother says. I'll manage. I always have. And soon, the house is filled with the warm glow from the fire, the sounds of laughter, the smell of a roast, and the little girl could not possibly be more happy. Thank you for everything else. After dinner, the girl asks her father for another story about the pilot. He looks at her as a smile slowly spreads across his face. My friends, Let's all go together and listen to Father's story. This way. Meek will go. My child, they have returned with the milk in a region. Insert Pokemon. Oh my music. god, Cheese cloning is on. Cloning cloning is on. Is on. Hold up. I know my cloning is on. I am happy to oh, share my avatar with everyone. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Pog, we're all he gonna wants everyone cubes. to become him. Well, one of us what? has to change. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, Pog, contrary, we became I constantly try to mimic all of you mortals to be as wonderful as you. So it is only right <laughs> that I share my form with all of you. Oh, what? Oh, no. I kind of want, like, a green one. Oh, that's creepy. It's out of hand. Mode. There's now, like, 12 of them. I will kindly ask that you do not change the view of the story, story as survive. this could be distracting. Apologies, friends. I can see the panties. Yes. Of we wouldn't know which cube to position. listen to. Ascend to cube hood, yes. gentlemen. Oh, no. After the tour. Yeah, the cubes are pretty trippy. I'm just going to want to look at them the whole time. <laughs> My friends, All right. the story Jeez. continues. My dear fellow tour guides, is everyone here? My friends, just a moment. We're waiting on a few. The ancient evil survives. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's here. Crap.
Oh, damn it. Uh, damn it, who was the guy who gave me that build chill avatar? I lost it. Crap. Everyone turned into two bad I lost. Use it, use it. Alright, we're all here. Let's go. The story continues. The young girl jumps into bed, and the father and mother sit either side of her. The father tells another story about his daughter's favorite hero, the pilot. Each time the father would revisit this story, the pilot would be on a new adventure. But each time, a few themes remain the same. The pilot flies to new worlds with their legendary ship. And wherever they go, they meet new friends who need their help. The odds would be stacked against them. But thanks to their trusty legendary ship, the pilot always saves the day. The girl re remains awake till the very end. And then the father asks, as he does at the end of every story. <laughs> so why do you think the pilot helps people? The young girl squeezes her bunny doll and cheers. Because it's the good thing to do. The mother and father look at one another, smile, and then laugh. The daughter doesn't know what happened. But she laughs with them anyway. As her parents leave the room, the girl asks if, when she grows up, she can fly to other worlds to help people like the pilot. Of course, the father says, <laughs> you'll be the greatest pilot, and someday you'll save the day too. The mother looks out the window. They tuck her in. The father turns off the light, and they leave the door ajar for the daughter. My friends, let's go back downstairs and let her sleep. This way. Good night. Mm -hmm. Crap. Damn, nobody else said goodnight. I didn't want to wake her up, bro. Is with the boys. Okay, I know I keep asking this, but who gave me that big chill the... avatar earlier? Because I forgot to favorite oh. it, and yeah. That was me. Sorry, Game I moments? forgot. I'm... Yeah, sorry. It's fine, it's fine. Let me just scroll through my favorites. I hate it when my favorite hidden button don't work. I feel you, man. My friends, the story oh, continues. Thanks. The mother and father sit together in the living room. She asks him if he did what he set out to do, and if he was tracked. He says the same thing he always says. Of course not, he was careful. He starts talking about being able to get away with unregistered flights. And the military's tendency to turn a blind eye to a certain amount of excess cargo when she stops him with a finger on the lips. She reminds him that she knows all of this already. He laughs and gets in one more detail. She will always know when anything is approaching thanks to the radar he stole. If a military vessel gets near, it will notify her. She nods. She knows this already, too. They both decide that it's a topic for another time. Her husband is home again. She missed him dearly. And so, they go to bed. The mother is woken suddenly. It's the father. He's talking about something on the radar, headed for the refugee camp. She rubs her eyes, confused. I have to go, says the father. I have to get them out. She doesn't understand. He pleads for him not to leave again, still not sure what exactly is happening. She suggests that it is just a scout, or an error. No, the father says, 
and his voice frightens her. Look, look at the radar. The mother looks, and her heart drops. The signal is enormous, the largest airship she's ever seen, and it's headed directly for the rebel camp off of the radar's edge. That's... she begins, but her voice falters. Yes, says the father. The Dark Monument airship. Last time it was deployed, it laid waste to everything from Eternic to the Aquavi Islands. The death toll was in the millions. Fire fell from the sky for weeks after, and to this day, nothing grows there. Hidden forest camps, underground bases, networks under towns, it doesn't matter. Nobody is safe from this thing. Sending it there could only mean he doesn't finish. He doesn't need to. I'll join you, the mother says. I was an engineer in the military. I can help. You were, until they discharged you for your condition. He takes hold of her shoulders and looks her in the eyes. The moonlight from outside dims, and the room goes dark. I need you to stay here. Protect our daughter. The gray soldiers will easily detect her potential. They'll take her away from us. We can't let our daughter become another weapon for them. The mother feels as though she is in a nightmare. Can't... can't you contact the Ethos Coalition for help? The Coalition's resistance ships won't make it in time. I... I can outrun that abomination. I smuggled them into the camp in the first place, so it's up to me to get them out of there. I'm their only hope. His hands slide down her arms, and he takes hold of her fingers. She's trembling. Uh, I was the same as them. A refugee on the run, remember? And then you rescued me. I have to return the favor. It's, it's the good thing to do. Reluctantly, she nods. He kisses her and rushes out into the night with his things. The house is cold and dark once more. And the mother and daughter are left alone. A year has passed. The father has not returned, and the daughter has just turned six years old. The mother lost contact with the Ethos Coalition months ago. Every night she waits by the radar. Tonight her daughter is with her, and together they watch, wondering if the moon is going to reappear. The silence is broken by the daughter. Mama, are, are you going to listen to the radio all night again? The mother doesn't answer. Daddy said it's bad for your heart to stay up. The mother looks down at her daughter, smiles, turns off the radar, holds her for a while, and puts her to bed. She promises she will sleep on time and closes the door. The mother goes back to the radar and turns it on. She listens with her head in her arms. She listens until sleep takes her. Nani? A loud voice screeches. Attention! Attention! This area is under martial law by order of the Grey. Surrender all ether users immediately or face execution. She changes her channels, but it's everywhere. She presses her hands against her ears, but the voice fills her mind. Then she looks at the radar, and she sees it. It's... Already over the forest? The cursed ship is here. But why? No, she doesn't have time to think. They have to escape. The mother rushes upstairs, wakes her daughter, and dresses her. 
The daughter only has time to grab her bunny doll before a banging sound echoes from the ground floor. The sounds of splintering wood terrifies them both. They run toward the outside balcony. Quickly, my friends, this way. Oh. Run. This way. Go, go, Where go, go. We gotta run, no, baby. So Speed one. Oh no! Oh, oh shit! Fine. Don't worry what? about it. Everything's fine. Oh, oh shit! Everything is not fine. <laughs> Everything's just. Everything is fine. It's all fine. I don't think so. Yes. Charmander, you are supposed to jump. Working a good coat of paint. All I need now is a table and a chair. Yeah, exactly. Just, just, just bring, just sprinkle a little water there. You know, just. Well, we're right by we're right by a pond. We we can fix this. We can fix this. This is what happens. Don't worry, I'm the freeze guy. Wait a minute, I'm ice. I I don't win here. Fire help! Fire beats ice, so I think you're at a loss here. Just jump, you bastard! Oh, just jump! Well, she's in the back rooms now. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Jump! When you accidentally Jump. download Wayne Raw from an illegal website. Do a flip! Do a flip. Do a flip. <laughs> the story <laughs> continues. Who are they? Cries the little girl. Mama, I'm scared. The mother holds her daughter tight and jumps from the balcony. She hits the ground hard, landing on her side. A sharp pain shoots through a broken rib, but her daughter is safe, and that's all that matters. She stands and looks around. The entire forest is in flames. They must have detected her. There, a path through the walls of fire. It's the only way. My friends, follow me. <laughs> oh, no. oh, through shit. the fires and flames. Oh, Dun, dun, Dude, the big ass ships to our left. You are on fire. Oh shit! My friends, over here, the story continues. Not yet, guys. Woo! Look at the cube of darkness. She struggles to run. Her daughter is heavy. She glances over her shoulder. Dark figures are circling the house, peering through the clouds of smoke. Then the mother looks up, and she sees it. A horrifying shape eclipses the moon. Its silhouette drops a blanket of slow-moving shadow, smothering the land below in darkness. The airship creeps slowly, unstoppably, toward them. She places her daughter on her feet and kneels to look her in the eyes. Mama is going to run, and you must run too. She barely manages to get the words out. You must not let go of my hand. Do you understand? Do not let go. Is that a monster? The little girl stammers with eyes welling up. No, don't look at it, the mother cries. Take my hand and don't let go. One of the soldiers yells in the distance. The mother grips her hand tight, and they run. The mother's heart is racing, the fire is unbearably hot, and the smoke scrapes in her throat. My friends, the mother and daughter have been spotted and are now pursued by the Dark Monument. Together, they must find a way through the burning forest. And so must all of you, as this is your first quest. Click the pressure save point, and as fast as you can, run for their lives! Let's go! And don't get caught. Oh, 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 this is gonna be a fun game. Yes, you can. Yeah. <laughs> Avoid the flames if possible. Guys. 
damn it. <laughs> White power right here, right here, right here. Oh, goodness. <laughs> you are one Very careful, that's how you make it through. That's what's going on. Maximum extermination! Sometimes I just have to walk through firewood. Over here. Over here, follow the light. The light. Because you were the thing you can get me. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 I think I, I think I burned myself more times than I did in the last I guess. 17 years. Yeah, this might be the first one. Mm -hmm. Oh, I ran into the progress. fire like 10 times on yeah, like, the middle of your shit. Story. We have yeah, 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 been getting certain pieces of information. No, I don't think there has been a tour where we've literally gained nothing. Fair enough. I feel like we might have sure, to maybe small bit of progress, but any little nudge forward brings us closer to solving yeah, everything. Yeah. I found it funny when the. the Fair enough. Day, like, just always yeah. But, uh, yeah, but I do feel like we're gonna pass that one seat. We know what we need. Dalek says exterminate. Doctor pulls out Uno reverse card. Got fucking wrecked. Where you go? I've never been in anything like this. I'm rolling. I'm happy with you. I'm trying to get me round. My team and I have put our hearts in the pog. Look at him rolling. Oh, for sure. It's a huge amount of respect that I, that, uh, yeah! that I have for you to know. Yeah! Awesome. Good choice. 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 Wait, what happened? Your kind words mean so much. Thank you. Oh, don't be doctor. My eyes, I was looking at what your favorite was. Why is the Geo dead? Oh. I have no I idea. Pebble. Why you guys are. Quickly, let's sell parts. I realize you have to Okay, that's just getting old. We are gathered here today in memoriam of whoever the fuck this is. <laughs> but I sell your parts, Real King. Would you like that? The lady over there has. I can't regenerate my parts like you can. I know. That's what makes me so jolly. Oh god, I almost. We haven't flooded the market with your parts yet. Yet. Bold of you to assume I'm not flooding the market with my parts on my, in my own time. Yeah, apologies, my, my friend guys, like crashed and he's just the making his way through the spotlight we'll just thing buy again. Them and sell at a higher Fine. price. Fine. Yeah. This, no, this little just... shit. Geo can never win. <laughs> we will win uh, the market. Uh, we'll always be the man. Alright, James is here, we're good to go. You can click tab and go to the fast travel menu to get here quickly, should you need to. Oh, fast travel, nice. Did you just try to freeze me? No. Wait, that was a point. That actually looks like a fist bump with your ass. Oh, yo, yo. For now. Hello. For now. Alright, so I guess I. I'm on the My friend, no, we are waiting on just a few more. I beg your patience. 
We are waiting on just a few more. I beg your patience. So you heard the last one. A trillion years I'm waiting for my own decay to vanish. There are a couple of things. Just kidding. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. I convinced this child to go on the tour. It's Jeff from Final Fantasy. Thank you. I'm gonna keep making cold puns until I freeze that little bastard. Bro, I think you need to chill out. Come on, man. Damn, that's cold. I know. <laughs> Back is so curved when you get that picture of you. I think so. Toasty. Nah. Is that the slide fest one? <laughs> So yeah, I just, yeah, oh baby, yeah, I did, and I upgraded the, the back. That reminds me. I don't think they made it. Wait, I like it when it says Slayhe. I think it goes up with Tantalus. I like it better when it says Slayhe. I think they're missing a little bit. Slayhe. I'll probably just throw that one, maybe. Oh yeah, like another version. I'll throw it, I'll get the next version. I'm apparently being blamed for the fire in the forest. Man, I also need to make his own slime. I'm sorry. My God. Just one more time. I am I'm sorry. 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 I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not that dirty, uh, what the f- where's all this dust Hags? coming from? Nice. Fucking uh, dusty. Dirt on the ground. Ah, I wish I had some snacks, but we don't have anything at home. <laughs> what do you think? But if it's a long time, you gotta dust off. That being said, it doesn't make much sense, given that it's a third year end. Buy anything from Matthew? How could you? Slinging mud on this thing. Oh, you must be from California. He got a text mix this one. Me too, man. What is this? Uh, hang on, hang on, on, hang on. I think we missed the spot. Friends, <laughs> 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 travelers, your attention, please. My friends, your attention, please. Apologies. Everyone, everyone, quiet down, please. Quiet down. Okay. Ten thousand apologies for interrupting your merrymaking. Congratulations on making it through the burning forest. The mother and daughter have made it somehow. Please walk this way. Walk this way. Thank goodness for the rain. Talk this way. Talk this way. Talk this way. Walk this way. Yes, my favorite part. I go. The story continues. Water. The mother Fire. and daughter stagger into a secluded clearing. Nearby is a tent, an old campfire, and a pond. Raindrops pat against the canvas, the leaves of the trees, and the water surface. The ground squelches beneath every footstep. The rain is cold, but the chill soothes the mother's burns. They won't have to worry about the fire spreading this far. Inside the tent, the mother speaks words of comfort to her wailing child, cradling her in her arms. The traumatized little girl grips her bunny and buries her face into the mother. The rain masks her tears, and she soon sleeps. The mother, however, does not, and keeps watch all through the stormy night. When the last of the daughter's sniffles subside, She begins to dream of a faraway place, a dark place. She descends into a nightmare. My friends, please use the nightmare save point.
Nightmare safe? Huh? Does anybody oh, this see that? The blue one? Nightmare, nightmare. Is it in oh! Oh, what's good Wait, don't walk Stay here. I'm coming. Oh, no, it's a You're going to the sh. Guys, I'm trying to make it. Well, it looks like you're going to the <laughs> Shadow like Realm. Shadow Realm. We're going to die. <laughs> oh, it looks this, like that fleshy this. cube that uh, harassed me back in VK5. <laughs> Damn, so this is the new song went after he sent him to the Shadow Realm. He came My friend, your attention, please. I'm just saying the things that My friend, your attention, please. Hey, 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 everyone, everyone. Okay, guys, guys. Oi, can you shut the fuck up? Silence! Apologies for interrupting, but I assure you, you're going to love this next part. Tonight's NPCs, please come forward. And stand next to me. And then change into your searchlight avatar in front of the group. Oh. That's funny. I That's see funny. everything. Oh dear. I know what you did last summer. My friends, can all of you see? I left no Luna, witnesses. Tamor and Geo Nexus, please enable their avatars completely. I repeat, please enable Luna and Geo's avatars completely. How do I enable? Oh, Luna. Menu click. You enable ah, by clicking on the person with your menu open and selecting the avatar. Yeah, let's let that yeah. <laughs> My friend, let's get that W tutorial bots be oh. like. Listen carefully. The NPCs will now turn on their searchlights and then they will take their place in the nightmare. My friends, a figure is suddenly aware of their surroundings. The walls are cold and slick, the floor is a solid void, and the air shimmers with a shadowy haze. Unknown figure looks about able to see anything what am I doing here I was searching for something perhaps the figure thinks there are voices audible in the distance echoing and distorted drawing closer the figure realizes they can't stay here they must find a way out and so must all of you as this is your next quest Listen carefully, travelers. Search for a way through the darkness and avoid the monsters at all cost. Getting caught in an NPC's cone of light will fracture the girl's hope. We'll hear thunder crash. If you are caught, keep moving through the dark. She dreams for you. And your quest begins now. Go. Arrows are above that'll guide you. Let's go. Let's go. Let's fucking do this. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Go go go. Oh, no. I got you. Carp eyes. Yeah, ceiling. Eyes on the ceiling. Let's do this. Pog, I just murdered my son. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna say that. Well, I'm a free dumb. Free dumb. Free dumb. What, what am I seeing right now? What is this? I feel like if we got fucked up way too many times, this is why we would have gotten better. You playing Twister? But I think right, I'm, I'm gonna twist on one sec. Oh, 
I always have the ability to set fuck? up this board wherever I go. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, no. Oh, we can get our flame. Yeah, I have oh, still, never mind. Yeah. I'm actually very happy. I placed yeah. one of my feet. Piss off. Yay. Mm -hmm. Like Jack Torrance and Bill Murray had a baby. <laughs> Oh, it is. <laughs> it is. I was just I'm actually not sure how long we have. Mm -hmm. And there's yeah, now a phone. Yeah, I know so there's a total of like four one... people. Oh my God. Just about four more people in the maze. This looks like it. Yeah, so we probably don't have the time to play at the moment. Maybe when we get back to the rendezvous, so what the fuck I saw it. I saw it. Game. When, when we get, when we get back in the after much? party, we can. Just no, frustrated that I can't, can't get this to work. Well, at least you have it. That's not a good thing. I. Yeah, yeah, I'm just chilling here. Yeah, what the crack is no. No. It, it disappears. I really love some beans. <laughs> Get the macaroni <laughs> and the beans. <laughs> oh, yeah, let us get some mushrooms. <laughs> beans. Uh, uh, beans. Make it out so what cut. happened was someone allegedly put a spider up your ass and uh yes you heard heard that right let me help with that they put a spider up their ass and uh i was hanging out at the end the proof were there and of course they pled innocence well don't get beamed while searching for beans they were drinking while they were having this like whatever that court case and uh i missed it because i was exhausted from a long day of work so that sucked so i woke up and uh, like like five hours later well i'm here with you <laughs> that doesn't suck that's like right. do you do you want to You mean all on fifty people? Oh, cool. Everyone, back. Indeed. Everyone, shut up and look at the shape. Friend. Oh, My friends, are, yes, you are the, the, the reader. We have observed that all of you here were singing extremely loudly. I would like to ask that you do this again next time because you were apparently having a very good time. And that's exactly why we do this. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The god is a nightmare. Time to party. Exactly. My friends, oh, my apologies. The story, the terrible story, will now continue. Let's get to the maze. We're trying our hardest. The girl wakes herself up screaming in the dark of night her eyes filled with tears as she frantically calls for her mother quickly she comes to comfort her terrified child the daughter begins describing a dark place with monsters but she struggles to speak through her trembling the mother rocks her in her arms telling her it was just a nightmare not to worry the daughter tries to go on about how the person in her nightmare was searching for something but her voice is too shaky. The mother interrupts, 
telling her it was not real. She's safe now. Together, they sit rocking for a while as the rain dies down, revealing a morning sun, shining like a golden orb between parting storm clouds. The mother thinks to herself that the town of Shade has always been a place rebel supplies move through. Surely, clues to the Ethos Coalition are there. The mother checks the sky. Clear. For now. My friends, this way. <laughs> Let's go! I'm gonna be completely what could possibly go wrong? Remember everyone, the rebel this army is everything. Everything. the good everything guys possibly in every go wrong. you read. They're Not always helpful. the good guys. Cough, cough, lies. But what about in Star Wars? always trust the rebel army. Yeah, the re every this single person in the rebel army in Star Wars is a good guy. And they have nothing wrong the morally with them. Oh no. <laughs> There's so many options. Yo, it's this part. <laughs> she I mean, what? Oh, oh my. Wrong this time. Excuse me, I'm gonna go do it. Are we going in already? Remain. I love this place. <laughs> My friend, Wait, hi. The story continues. The town of Shade. What? Is a small, what? Easy, unfriendly place. The people here don't smile or greet each other as they pass. The mother and daughter feel unwelcome. The mother doesn't know who to trust or who is loyal to the Grey City. First, she needs to find a safe place for them to get some proper rest. The mother books a room, which the innkeeper says will be ready a little later. She checks the sky, then tells her daughter that they should gather supplies while they wait, as they likely have a long way to go tomorrow. Oh my. My friends, this oh, oh, is your oh. next quest. Listen carefully. All of you must explore the Town of Shade. Scattered around are various supplies and clues the mother and daughter need. If you find an interesting looking item, please click it. It will appear in your tab key inventory once... My friends, you have minutes to search and you must return yeah. here before five minutes is up my friends i repeat five minutes you okay. must return five minutes here okay. before five minutes is up all right no. start exploring no we gotta look we gotta look look around and so your quest begins good luck that'll find um, um, I was looking at the clock. I was kind of like thinking of an idea, but since this map's already been made, it's like. Alright, let's head on. Oh, there, there's, there's the, like a there's like a the thing here. Kit. There's also a thing here. Thing. Check this out. Remake. Get down. Yeah. Interesting. I what else can we find? Kit. I found a first aid kit. Here, what did y'all find here? I would like to buy this.
an ocarina over here in the corner. Oh, oh, is that a bag? No, it's nothing. There's two tied for shields that we need. Okay, cool. Piston. Can you stop trading the ice everywhere, dude? I haven't been here yet. Oh, I was just here. Well, like here. There's a good shield when I need I need one. Wait, um, when? Was that helmet? Right hand above remember. your head, and I then press the menu button. Remember I found a teammate to remember I drank oh. it. Nice. Oh. I was going to find a shield or any weapon. Is it bad? I found a teammate to remember I drank it. I just skipped like an entire part of this town. Okay, so because the Athena's memorizer was helpful last time, I think we should take that. Okay, so because the Athena's memorizer was helpful last time, I think we should take that. Okay, so because the Athena's memorizer was helpful last time, I think we should take that. And then, you know, a shield and a weapon. When we're deciding that kind of thing. Yeah, I'm just trying to have some time to think. Yeah. Wait, how do you pick your memorizer? I can use a healing item. 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 Mm -hmm. 
Fran, you're out of time. And to make sure we had a problem with sealed and stored. What about last time? We can't bring it this time. No way that you're going to waste the time. I think we should have oh, so oh, 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 it. Oh, 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 oh,
the mother and the daughter have collected everything in the town. What we're deciding is what items to put of, of everything in the daughter's bag. The mother already has the heart medicine and everything that's necessary. We want to figure out what the daughter herself will carry with her. Oh. We need a shield. Therefore, we need a shield. I think, I think uh. we should take a shield, like the pilot shield, a weapon, like yep. the iron pedal, which is a dagger, and, and something a little bit more mystical, like the time egg, or that interesting looking scarf on the tower. Didn't the time egg turn to dust oh, last time? Wait, you know what? 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 You know Okay, so I think we should take a into account that she's still a little girl, so we got got to make sure these things are stuck. That's not how this works, bro. Nope, that's, that's not, not how it works. works. We are fighting in the dream dimension where we are a shadowy. Okay, oh, right, right. So I propose, okay, I propose yes, our third item is the, is the TIA director's coat. Thank you for your time. No! Oh, uh, hey, what's the thing with so I'm allowed to suggest that. <laughs> oh, yeah, so okay. Did we take any vials before? So, so, the yeah, yeah, I, I, I don't know how good we of a shield it is. I don't know how the time, the time egg. I believe that the VIA has been mentioned. It's just we have to armor outside of the field. It will have potential effects. Alright, let's see what happens. The iron so, oh, the pilot shield! Yeah, the pilot shield, okay. I forgot what the, the, the weapon was, it was a dagger something? Uh, it was a petal or something, I'm not sure. Oh yeah, the petal. Oh my god. Okay, well, Raise your hand if you got a legitimate suggestion for a third item. Or start yeah, bouncing. I'll call code. on you. Uh, suggestion. Um, I, we heard you. Extra ARDX. Extra ARDF. The point is promise. Yeah, I got that too in my head. It item. sounds that cool. Extra thing. Um, do we have some no, shields? I feel like the pilot is promised. We already got an item and a yeah, shield lined up. We're same. trying to pick the third item. Good. And we don't okay. have much time, so I'm trying to get through. I have a suggestion. I have a suggestion. Okay, equalization. The anti what? Uh, I was just getting attention I said for losing. Angel. Yes, oh, okay. <laughs> we don't. We have no idea what some with the rats come to you scarf can do just because it's a scarf which doesn't match up with any other of the things that. Okay, so. So. Mm. Because I, I don't, I don't know how this works, but I think. I still think we should take the time egg. The first aid, like the splint that I have. Yeah, because I have the time egg. Okay. Yeah. What the is the dream of Sarong? Because, because uh, uh, so uh, you get a red plus and useless. Redundant for healing, okay. which is okay. I mean, oh, we well, might need it though. Actually, so we might need it though. Okay. 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 Yeah. 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 What do you? What is your suggestion for that third? So item? I mean, it was I was just inquiring about the dream of Sarong, but apparently anything involving dreamers is useless, according to the thing attached to my hand. Ah. Yeah, Dream Egg right. turned to dust, and all the things we're dreaming, it would probably also turn to dust, because you're taking it into a dream realm. Yeah, they have. I've seen it. Yeah. Okay. Also, Anyone like... <laughs> and for reasons... Please. For reasons that you will... 30 seconds. seconds. I do believe we should take the Well, we already egg. got shields lined up. <laughs> 30 seconds. I agree with Time Egg. egg. Because that's an electronic, not a shield. Okay, okay. 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 Time Egg as well. Time Egg, time egg shield... And Lucian, what was the weapon you suggested? Iron pedal. Iron pedal. The black pedal. The iron pedal. The iron pedal. The iron pedal. The iron pedal. Okay, everyone, before the time runs out, let's all confirm we're doing iron pedal, pilot shield, and time egg. Got it? Yes. Sounds good. If you get called on, mention one of those three items. What if every egg turns to dust? One, zero. Well then. My friends, time has expired. Well done. I have contemplated, perhaps in the future, I would ask all of you to divide and do three groups. The bathroom group, the bed group, and the sofa group. But all of you have actually unified. Congratulations on working well together. It started off rough, but all of you were victorious. My friends, I will now ask you for the three items, and I will begin 
with you, Gamma, the Robo. Uh, um, Tell me, what items. is one item, one item the daughter will carry? The, the gray pedal, I think it was called? Iron, iron pedal. Yeah, iron pedal, iron pedal. The iron pedal, I see. And you, D Boy five zero one 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 zero. What is the second yeah. item the daughter will carry? Uh. Were you not paying attention to the entire thing we were doing? <laughs> <laughs> not gonna, no, I wasn't paying attention. It's just everyone kept on, talking over Phoenix. everybody, oh, and I really oh, couldn't geez. tell what was happening. Time hack. Time. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Time egg. Yeah, what, what, they, what they're whispering. Oh, Give me time egg. Let me oh, speak. Crap. <laughs> no. The Are you time egg. Is this that is correct? the second time. Yes. Yeah. Well yeah. said. Yeah. Good choice. Yeah. Velocity. <laughs> what is the third item the daughter will carry? Um, what was it? The pilot shield. Yeah. The pilot yeah. shield. Yes, that's I yeah. see. That is right, it. I got what we wanted. Oh. Good work, Good gentlemen. Job. And ladies and gentlemen. And so wait, and we beings. expect purely into glorious Another melee beings. combat. Okay. And trust me, if you follow us into a specific most area, you will know why we need these particular <laughs> items. <laughs> we have My friends, the uh, story okay. continues. Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> The mother sits on the bed, leaning against the window frame. She's tired of running, tired of hiding, but she cannot stop. Not yet. She looks through the window at the town as the evening sun sinks behind the gray clouds, painting the buildings with a soft pink light. The daughter jumps up on the bed, cuddles up to her mother, and holds tightly onto her bunny doll. Are we going to stay here? She asks. I want to go home. The mother brushes her daughter's hair to the side. Not for long. We're going somewhere else tomorrow. Somewhere safe. Is that where daddy went? The daughter looks up at her mother, hopeful. I think so. You need to sleep, so you can walk with me there tomorrow. You need to sleep, too, the little girl nudges her and places a hand over her mother's heart. She can feel it beating steadily. The feeling comforts her. Daddy said, I need to protect Mama. The mother breaks into a heartwarming smile. You already are, my angel. Daddy also says you're a good luck charm, as though you have friends watching over you. Friends watching over me and Bunny? She looks at the ceiling and around the room, but nobody's there. The mother laughs. <laughs> the daughter squeezes her bunny doll and goes silent. She thinks deeply for a six-year-old. Mama, will my friends watch over your heart too? She puts an arm around her daughter and pulls her in. Her answer comes only as a whisper between them, a fragile breath. I hope so. I hope so. The daughter nods and snuggles up close. She falls asleep within minutes. The mother wipes tears from her own eyes and looks back out the window. Night has come. My friends, mother will keep watch while we all sleep, for what is good never last. Please. Use the nightmare save point to follow the daughter into her dreams once more.
Another one? Oh, Yo, she just can't catch a break. Don't go forward. Right, over here. No, go over here. Not go further. Hmm. It's poopy. Can you fall off? She do not be sleeping well. Oh, oh she, she just needs off. to be yeah, nice sleep cool. without a single Wagon man. doobie dragon. <laughs> Wagon doobie dragon. <laughs> Hey Ren, Dizo. Oh. Yep. I, 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 I can fly, myself. suckers. Oh no, the Pokemon. I just noticed I was leaving a stream of fire as I fell. To Tonight's NPCs, uh, no, I please come stand next to me and change <laughs> into your dream <laughs> eater Wee. avatars. Oh, Show oh, them to the group. Oh, wow, dream eaters you sound first, pretty Luna. scary. These you sound pretty first. menacing. What do they look like? Mm. Oh, oh, dream. Oh, that's oh, kind of scary. Oh, shit. oh yeah. Oh, what about you? Oh, wow. Still shiny avatar, yeah. Feels kind of like Hollow Knight, but humanoid. Oh. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, jeez. 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 Oh
Lale Lee too slow. <laughs> no. Lale Lee too slow. <laughs> too slow. It's part of the distraction. We're gonna lose the riddle if we just laugh. Come on, step it up. The whole time. They're gonna make it hard. Chili dogs. <laughs> Sorry, I'm sorry, I left too many times to take the long run. Okay, die a little more quiet. Your breath's now. Calm yourself. Hey. You need your brain and prime time functioning, uh, function. Yes. <clears throat> Everyone is here. NPCs, please feel welcome to begin. We have a riddle for you. Okay. An absolute paradox. You will find it in the middle. It is the bridge between the beginning and the end. What is it? Oh, shit. I have to... I couldn't hear that. I will restate the riddle for you all. You'll find it in the middle. He said... An absolute you'll find it. paradox, absolute. you will find it in the middle. It is the bridge between the beginning and the end. What is it? Now everyone, be silent for 30 seconds as we all contemplate. Thirty seconds have passed. Do we have ideas? Do not I got speak one. over each other. Mind if I give one? I agree with Protag on sure. that. Life. That sounds close. Yep, I am 100% of both of that. What did Protag um, say? I agree. Paradox in the middle. Beginning of present. Yeah, that's what beginning I Beginning and end. About. Pres I also thought about the present. Life? The yeah, now. that makes sense too. Hmm. The present. I would still say right? life. I was gonna say time. I'm gonna go with your guys' answer like, oh, because I literally just every... couldn't come up with anything. Me Not a time. No, paradox. I feel very strongly about present. Yeah, I know I like presents. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Also, what else? It's my idea was the begin like, between the beginning and the end. That one's like a straightforward answer. Right. Life. I mean, I mean it is a true line and riddle. I just hope life. it won't be too complicated. I, I do it's... think the present fits. However, I think honestly there are multiple answers to this riddle. That being the present said, is I in the middle the of the beginning and the end. Strong. Like the, the like the future is the end the and, is and the past is the beginning. I think I think life would be better yeah, fit. Yeah. To me life I mean, just makes the most time? sense. Explain how life. Well, explain life. How life well, because life is, is a beginning everything. and life, and life is, 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 is a beginning. Yeah, life is the beginning. It's not in the middle, it is the beginning. Death is the end. I still say life. I say present. Uh, what about eternity? Life. Because you can't have I, I have to go to bed. Uh, bye, everybody. Peace out. Okay, bye. Okay. Can't have something before eternity. Somebody freeze that tree for me. How about now? Paradox. Beginning and end. But infinity has no beginning nor end. What about time? Yo, yeah, that makes sense. Time? I think... Time. I mean, eternity, time, eternity... What's made of paradox is in life itself? It's the present. It's in the middle. Between the beginning and the middle. There is time between the beginning How is that paradoxically in the middle? It's not. Because time's always moving. 
There's always the oh, present. No. No. No I'm minute. guessing we're split no on way. eternity and Infinite. present. Infinity. 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 I think we should answer present. Yeah, I, I, I personally think it'd be eternity. Fuck it, man. Lucian should be our answer, present. our answer guy. He's gonna tell the answer. Present. Present. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. I guess. Yeah. 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 One answer. Present. Is it eternity or present? Present. present. Come on, guys. Present. 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 Here we go. Lolly mm -hmm. Lee Lele. Uh. Lolly <laughs> Lele. You, you will die slow. Ah, correct. Let's go. It's incorrect. Right. It's okay. incorrect. Oh, it's incorrect. I heard oh, it. incorrect. Oh, fuck. Shit. Can you say I the middle word? Nice, nice try to sink, sink lines. <laughs> Darn. An eternity? Is it life? Oh, or is it? They're like really quiet. I have the volume all the way up there. Uh, yeah, oh, well, it was a strong, it was <laughs> a strong one though, so. Even though, that was a hard one. This is kind of tough. The fuck? Why is it so tough? Well done. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's the class can be tough. Hey, you. See Metal Gear. Metal Gear. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> A weapon surpass Metal Gear. <laughs> That's so good. Uh, no, fast. Thank you. We failed. Uh, My friends. friends. I'm always failing this side. Which we're ending it in. Do not worry. You are making progress. The true challenge awaits. The unknown figure passes between the strange nightmare manifestations and enters a new space. There comes the scent of dust and rust. They look ahead, peering into the shadows that feel distant. And a shape begins to take form. It is colossal. It hangs in the abyss, majestic and imposing, as the person perceives more and more of it. Its wings cut through the darkness like great blades of night. And there it waits, motionless, expectant. My friends, it is time to wake up from this nightmare. Please, just the wick save point. Ooh, yeah, it was, was cool, man. even though it was a hard one, man, but I good one. Wait, what yeah, it didn't seem much like a nightmare, it's more just a silly dream. I've always slept in the bathtub. I said, every time I fail a nightmare, I have horrible nightmares. Yeah, every time I fail a riddle, I have horrible nightmares. I fail a nightmare, I have horrible nightmares. I wake up with a little bit of an ache in my neck. What's your neck? Let me get the second part. What's your neck? Because the way your hand is sitting. I never really begins on this. An absolute paradox. Sitting on the palm of your hand, and the palm of your hand is. No, no, no. No, no, no. I'm talking about the print. I just know how much it's hard for you to see. Oh, paradox. You need to get one in the middle of the stand or whatever. Wait, come on. Time. Yeah. Wait, if it's in turn, it doesn't matter. I would have accepted time, but it's technically incorrect. The freaking psychic. Yeah, Wait, well, nah. I don't think that's because, mm, you know, but only because it's really good. Can, can, can you face dun, me dun, towards dun. the queue? Lots of thinking. My friends, the girl is jolted awake by a loud bang that shakes the room. A vase topples from the table mm. and smashes on the floor. We have to go get dressed. We have to go now. The girl tries to explain to her mother about the nightmare, about how she knows what the person is searching for. The room shakes again, cracking the window this time. The little girl stops mid-sentence when she looks through the broken, broken glass. Its okay. image distorted, <laughs> fragmented. It hangs in the night sky. It is here. 
The cursed monster is here. It's following us! The little girl shrieks before tumbling from the bed, pushing herself up against the back wall of the room. There are sounds of a firefight outside the town. Don't look at it! The mother comes to grab her. It's going to be okay. Mama is going to protect you, but we have to leave now. The world comes down around them. Everyone this way. Alright, I oh. think I just found something. What, what could it be? We're all gonna die. Oh, shit. Oh. Well, oh, come right. on at all. Everything. Squid, where's Squid? Oh, shit. Wait, what? This way! Whoa. Everyone, this oh, way! I this way! This time. We just no, running? We just running! I don't know. Oh, oh, I Come on. How about Charizard? I'm not even a legendary Pokemon, so I can't do it. My cable tangles. My cables are tangling so bad. I thought you'd be um, using the just, just make a loop. <laughs> then use the joystick. <laughs> oh, the mighty Q. Yeah, Whoa. Oh, the boss run. Follow the all-knowing Q. Follow the all-knowing oh, no. Q. Follow no. the all-knowing Q. Who's no. 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 gonna say that Pokemon line? You know, the whole oh, the Charmander I choose you thing. Right, this was the monster. Anyone gonna say it? Oh, this, was this, was the this was the monster? Oh, no. no. Dude, that is insane. I'm, I'm the fucking monsters are fucking there. Yeah, Holy I shit. Holy I can fight him. Shit. He's been there forever. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, Everyone oh, look in the air. No way. I just can't even talk to him. I have like... <laughs> okay, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> I'm joking. You know? We hijack it because we can. <laughs> My friends, my friends, your attention please gather around where you can hear clearly. The story continues. <laughs> the story continues, everyone, gather I've been around! for a long time. With daughter in tow, the mother makes her way to the town exit opposite the firefight. In the street, the mother spots a motorcycle lying on its side. She goes to lift it up right. Halt. A soldier appears. Armed with a gun blade. A gun blade? The town of Shade is now under martial law by order of the Grey. All civilians are to report for ether scatting. Come with me. The daughter holds her mother's hand tight. The mother states they were already scanned and have no potential. She slowly backs away. I said halt. The soldier orders. He then presses a button on his visor. The mother sees this and pushes her daughter to run and hide behind a wooden crate. With a racing heart, the mother now stands defiantly between her daughter and the towering soldier. His eyes go wide as he reads his visor display. What's this? You haven't been scanned. You both are coming with me. With his eyes on the ground, the soldier reaches for his comms, preparing to notify command of his discovery. The mother must think fast, and so begins your next quest. You have 30 seconds to decide as a group which of the following three options Grab to choose from. Attack, defend, or mother's instinct. Time defend. begins now. Either I believe it's defend or mother's fuck. instinct. Um, Do I have to defend right now? Mother always knows best. Uh, the mother yeah. the, the calms of the 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 I know, That's I remember doing that first. I know, it's so Please do defend. Mother's but instinct is you know, I remember doing Mother's instinct in VR, you know, you the VR, the VR conversion of this. I'm using proxy oh, for this elimination here. Um, We've got one that works on Mother's instinct and so one that works on Mother's instinct. Is what I'll be. Okay, look, use Mother's instinct when, you'll know when Mother's instinct is ready to be used. So we have to wait until we get there. Okay, defend. Five seconds. Defend, defend. Guys, let's defend. Yes. Defend! I mean... Uh, okay, Luminous Lulu 
What will the mother do? Um. Um. No. Uh. Defend. Yes. You really need to pay attention to the choices. Oh, no, no, She turns to run. Uh -huh. But before she can reach her daughter, he notices and pursues. She ducks just before he catches up. She grabs his arm from above her and uses his momentum and weight to shoulder throw him onto his hey, back. The timing. He hits the ground Whoa. hard and drops the comm device. She rushes to attack the downed soldier, delivering a full force kick to his unguarded face. His nose is crushed and all of his front teeth are knocked out. She raises her leg up to stop again, but he rolls to dodge. The mother is quick to kick towards his throat as he stands, but he catches her leg. And with his other arm, he makes a tight fist before hooking her hard in the cheek, fracturing her jaw. The oh, soldier fuck. has taken significant damage this round. Shit. Fog. Okay. The mother was knocked to the ground, but quickly gets up. The yeah. soldier shoulders his gun blade, aiming at her eyes. Attack, defend, or mother's instinct. 30 seconds. Oh, oh, um, it's attack either attack or mother's, or mother's instinct. instinct. Uh, the how, um, attack. What do we do? Maybe we do we do? Okay, there's alternate versions of this scenario. In this version of the scenario, defending led to the soldier being fine, but us getting hurt. So we either have to attack or do mother's instinct. It's context. I mean, attack. Chairman, do you use to aim. I actually missed it. I think it's trying to use scratch. Like, y'all follow my line of thinking? Yes. Because oh, no. Equalization. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. better not be blaming me for this again. You you know, do, uh, they're, 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 yeah, they're fighting, bro. Chaos kind of Isn't fight. Do, we, do we fight? Do we attack? Do we defend? This or do we... This is too much fire for a champion to attack. We never know what it's yeah, actually gonna be. You know, it's just these... ...species... ...iconic guy... ...and then just does like a random out of her... ...we never know what it's gonna be. I got to be a champion. I got someone I've been at. I say attack. But you attack, and it makes you an attacker. That's what I would be the way to go. Her baby. Back. Yeah. We must attack. All right. Well, Captain that's Panda. Captain Panda, what will the mother do? Yeah. Yeah. I think attack it's might work, cause like last time. Damn man, you scratch. Oh. <laughs> he said he declared it tough. Repeat it. She rushes the soldier. She's fast, but not fast enough. He takes the shot, no! hitting her deep in the upper leg. Seeing her slowed now, he moves in close. The soldier has taken no damage this round. Damn, yeah, it was Mother's Instinct. Well, we do know what we need to do next Fuck. time we get that. Oh, well, that was bad. That's <laughs> 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 we did get information. Hey, hey, hey. We don't know what to do next time. Yeah, that's getting the good idea of the story is all about information. Guaranteed. So now we know for next time when he's aiming at the eyes, the gun blade back, preparing for a forward thrust. Attack, defend, or mother's instinct. 30 seconds. <laughs> defend, or attack, defend. or defend. Defend, you gotta evade that. Like, need to defend. defend. Process of elimination, it's not a defend. Last time, yeah, last time the defend was like a counter hit. So, like, 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 and see, no matter what, he's like already injured. Yeah. Who's that? That's true. If he does like a faint or something, I'm just going defend. to cry. No matter what, defend, we, defend. Do, we always get our jaw broken and like shot. Let's see what happens. Oh, jeez. My health should be good. We don't know how to avoid that. Presto, PJS. What will the mother do? Defend. Uh, she defends. Yes. She turns just enough so the blade pierces only the air between her torso and arm. She grips the gun blade's length, 
hard and uses her weight to twist it free from the soldier's hands. He jumps to tackle her, but as they collide, she fires the weapon at point blank into his now burning guts. The gun blade is knocked out of reach while they both fall to the ground. Oh my god. She quickly moves to stand, but he pulls her back to the ground. He grabs her left arm, twisting it into a lock. She manages to unclip an incendiary grenade from his belt, but the angry soldier then brings his elbow down hard, breaking her arm at the wrist. The soldier has taken significant damage this round. That's happened as well. Oh god. Oh man. Yeah, this was pretty much every time she gets I'm the man, how <laughs> Witnessing all of this, the daughter screams for her mother. Now positioned between them, the soldier grabs the little girl and growls for the mother to drop the grenade or she dies. His guts are the daughter shouts, leave us chest. alone! Just as a yellow aura erupts around her. Attack, defend, or mother's instinct. 30 seconds. Mother's instinct! 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 Mother's no Buddy, you, we've yeah. tried Mother's Instinct on every run. I guess, then let's try Defend. What? But in, in, but in the no, VR no, con run, on. I remember this clearly. Rex, did it it mother's Instinct at this point. In front of me there. One thing that I'm pretty what sure. What will the Mother do? We might get better with something else. Uh, <laughs> never break. Uh, no! So, no! This thing is built like no. a fucking seal, not Shut gonna up. lie, like... Generally. She meets her daughter's eyes. And shouts. Protect us! The girl drops her bunny doll and closes her eyes. The aura explodes into a torrent of yellow flames. The soldier tries to block, but the pure ether rips into him, sending him flying through a wall. Severely injured, but still alive, the soldier gets up. Immediately, he runs to his mech, climbing up into the open cockpit. Just before the door closes, the mother throws the incendiary grenade inside. The ground shakes, but not because of the grenade going off. A shadow sweeps across everything. The dark monument now hovers over the town gates, dropping bolts of blazing fire in every direction. The mother grunts in pain as she lifts the bullet-riddled motorcycle up into an upright position. She calls to her daughter to get on, but the girl stands unmoving, staring at the monster in the sky. Quickly, she pulls her daughter up on the seat with her. She still has one strong leg and arm. The adrenaline is masking the pain. For now. We're going to be okay, she tells her daughter. I promise. We have to, she thinks to herself. Together, they speed away from the inferno that was the town of Shade. My friends, this way. Alright, that was mostly successful. The same result. I generally started thinking that this is life. Well, the name of that hearing actually. Genuinely, I think it's life. 
Parkour, parkour. Well, gee. It does Is it live, Boo. Wait. Oh. Sudden realization. Did we break the mother's arm? She did life food. Can life food transform we're, into a. We're oh, on. It's, okay. ten it's ten totally life food. <laughs> That's all right. They'll come back. Don't worry. Talking. Mm-hmm. She said, "Protect us. Save us." It's totally life, dude. It's totally life. Huh? Need to change. Doesn't. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. The story continues. They ride for hours. The trail is empty. The sound of the wind and the rumble of the engine slowly fade out in the mother's mind. All she can hear are her own thoughts alongside the painful thumps in her chest. The daughter holds on silently, eyes staring vacantly into the darkening sky. Angel, I'm so sorry. We're almost there. We will be in a safe place soon, the mother says. The daughter does not respond. This way. The Whoa. sky. The sky is dark. The outpost looms ahead. Various points of light moving about. The mother left the motorcycle on the road. It ran out of fuel a while ago. She leads her daughter by the hand, struggling to breathe as they walk. Finally, they're somewhere safe. Finally. They can take a rest, and she can heal her. Wait. Grace, something isn't right. This is meant to be a waypoint for smugglers. Why are there soldiers everywhere? Gray soldiers? The mother breaks down. She lets go of her daughter's hand and drops to her knees. This is hopeless. They can't escape. What is she even doing the information was shade from shade was incorrect and it hurts everything hurts the pain is unbearable it's getting worse mama the daughter's voice is tiny and feeble mama are you okay the mother looks at her daughter. You should sleep, Mama. I'll sleep too, and we can go to the dream world together. She takes hold of her mother's hand. I thought there were monsters there, but I know who it actually is. It's safe there, Mama. Let's go to sleep and forget this place. The mother listens to her daughter's words and begins to cry. She can't die here, and this poor child is already succumbing to the trauma. Her angel is losing herself. No. She has to be stronger. She has to make her own hope. The mother stands back up, takes back her daughter's hand, there has to be a way through here. My friends, this way. Press the bridge over the water. The water I do not want to touch. Bridge over the water. Oh, oh, no. oh, oh god. Oh, oh yeah, that one looks good. Oh boy. Oh, I'm in a worm. No. 
Holy moly. What's up, Eric? What's up? Oh, no, that must be climbed the Great Wall. My friends. What are you talking about? They stuff? sneak. They sneak through the building carefully, avoiding the patrols. They stop and remain silent as two soldiers approach one another. The soldiers stop to talk, and the mother listens carefully. Hey, I'm sure you heard, but Shade's been wiped from the map. Nothing left but ashes. It doesn't feel real, one soldier says with a worried tone. I'm not surprised. The Dark Monument is in the region, and Shade was a known supply point for the Ethos. But what if it comes here? They say it just destroys everything that's not a part of its unit. Unlikely. That machine they excavated is here. It's scheduled to transport for District Zero. They would not destroy something this important. You mean that creepy mech nobody is allowed to go near? Yeah. Rumor has it there's an ether amplifier on board. The scanners can't make sense of it. That's impossible. I thought you could only fit those on big warships. Don't you need to grow them or something crazy like that? Well, whatever it is, I heard they can't get the mech to work. It fries any equipment we attach to it. Hey, want to go see it before it ships out? Nobody is watching it now. No way. That thing gives me the creeps. The soldiers part ways to continue their patrols. Before leaving the area, knowing that the other gray mechs are locked with alarms, the mother concludes that the mech they spoke of is their only chance to leave this region. She looks at her daughter. The girl has been silent, staring vacantly at the wall since they have arrived. She wants to check if she's all right, but they need to move. This way. There's narration. Over Yo. Here, guys. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, kinda... Robots roll out. It's more Gundam than Transformers. Whoa, that's a motherfucking massive one. Holy shit. Whoa. Yeah, that one the story continues. There it stands alone. The air is thick around it. Drowning out sound and somehow the glare of the night lights. This is our only chance. If there's anyone up there, please help us. No. No, I can do this, the mother thinks to herself. It's warm to the touch. The cockpit eerily and silently opens. Not wasting time, the mother motions for her daughter to climb inside with her. But the girl refuses. The mother looks up and sees a guard in the distance slowly patrolling closer. She kneels down to her daughter's eye level and whispers in frustration that they need to fly this to where daddy is. The daughter backs away from her and the mech. She speaks with a quivering voice. No, that's not the right way. We need to wait here. What? The mother is confused and tries to reach for her daughter. We have to go now. No, it's the pilot in the dream, Mama. We need to wait for the pilot, the daughter says louder as she backs away. Angel, please, they are going to see us. 
I am the pilot, and we are going to fly this to where Daddy went. Get in now, please. No, we will be safe if we go to sleep. The daughter says louder, starting to cry. Stop, please, Angel, calm down. She pleads with her right arm outstretched. I don't want to go in there again, Mama. The child shrieks. It's too late. A soldier on the wall shouts and triggers the intruder alarms. Sirens start blaring and the daughter panics, running into her mother's arms. Blinding spotlights quickly discover their whereabouts, illuminating the mother and daughter holding one another under ghostly white light. The pilot will save us, the pilot will save us, the pilot will save us, she says over and over before fainting in her mother's arms. The sirens continue to blare, and the soldiers are making their way down the walls. The mother looks at her daughter's unconscious face, then over to the mech's open cockpit. It's pitch black inside. My friends, listen carefully. You have a choice to make, as this tour group will split into two. Oh. If you wish to stay awake with the mother, stand next to me. If you wish to follow the daughter into the darkest nightmare, stand next to my fellow tour guide, Trey Jim. Make your tour. Okay. Oh boy, I'm, I'm not I, ready I, for I, this. I, 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 this is this is. This, Are you this, ever this, ready this for this? This is the only viable way. Nope. This is the only viable way. Here's the thing, though. It it's all depends on everyone on Shin's side. Either way, uh, play spoiler. But what is this thing called? Yeah, the dream. No, we. I feel like no, this no. is the way to go. No, okay. No, I just do. Oh uh, well, you know. what, so sure, in that case. Story. What is this thing you call a thing? We must. I see, I see more what yellow than you. Know, so so you, 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 you don't have much time, I like, guess. Yeah, all the yellow names are over here. Well, the thing is, it also depends on the people on the other side. Remember? They have to do the doing as well. Make the right choices. Make the right choices. Listen to the team. I'm very interested in it happening. Hello, Tiki. Let's see how we do. As a collective, we you just away. love so making experiments, experiments, don't, don't you? Too, so we don't know which of us are the, are the ones that are doing it and which of us haven't. So we just have to put trust that in each other. Whatever happens, happens there, happens. <laughs> like, whatever happens there ha matters as well. So let's hope that they yeah, do this. Recognize let's the hope that those on Shin's side go good. <laughs> but we, we, well, you know what we got? We got the three items. My friends. Your attention, please. In just a moment, once Sheen's group is gone, we will begin. I, Trajim, will be your guide through the dark, and Mother will protect us while we descend into this final nightmare. Please. Wait for me on the other side of this blue save point. The final nightmare. Ah, oh, this song brings so much memory. Oh, this is scary. I'm scared. Oh, I am not ready. It is scary. Don't fall off, not coffee. I am the wait, wall wait, today. Wait, wait, wait. For the nightmare. To I'm ready for this shit. About to fall oh, off. Is floor. Oh yeah. Is this for dominance? I forgot about this floor. Floor. Oh my god, I'm so dominant. T pose for hope. Oh. Yes, T pose for hope. Yeah, T pose for hope. My friends, the story oh, continues. What are you pointing at me for? Oh. The unknown figure jolts awake with awareness as if they had just fallen up from high. The undulating void around them is giving off voices. 
The figure listens closely. A slow and faint heartbeat echoes between the scrambled words. They can't make sense of the sounds at all, but it feels somehow meaningful or important. That's her. No. My. The words come as but silent thoughts to the figure. Confused, they pursue the voices. Ah, memories of this. It's been a while since I've seen you in this. Memories and the rest of that song. Twilight. Yo. Oh, you gotta great. give it to the six year old though. She can, she can draw pretty well. She but pretty good. Lowercase. Yep, pretty damn <laughs> Not inside I, the blue. That is perfect, perfect spelling. Heart. At my age. Perfect spelling. A monumental Hello. tree stands tall in the void. There is a warm air of absoluteness about it. Something unfathomable. Something unifying the voices in the dark. The heartbeat is coming from this tree. Without a voice, the figure's thoughts burn in the darkness. This is mine. This was made for me. It was always made for me, but... Where are... The wings? Oh. Suddenly... The air goes cold. The void quakes and bubbles up with tar. It drips down the tree, and an image slowly emerges, reflecting off the black substance. A blood moon. Through every dream, Every story, every secret, every whisper, I will hunt you, and I will take back what is mine. I will devour your soul while your friends watch. Travelers, face me, face me and fight for your pilot's soul! Oh, what, oh, what, what, what the? Oh, 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 its face is naught but a maw with three jaws, a single eye gleaming in its gullet. Crowning the mouth is a heart, shimmering with all the colors held hostage by the monster. The abomination observes the figure standing in the middle of the nightmare, and the dream devourer readies to attack. The figure realizes they have items on them, and they quickly look over what they have. My friends, due to the choices you made earlier in the narrative, the following happens. Probably should have brought the pilot's promise. The Iron Petal becomes a bayonet, a melee weapon somehow familiar to the figure. The pilot shield becomes a sturdy silver shield, surely able to glance aside lethal blows. And the time egg 
becomes a glistening ruby knife, exuding enough ether to attack mm, magic. Yes. Oh, nice. Whoa. Okay, we got some good choices. Oh, nice. The time egg turned oh, into nice. something not related to time, oh. nor egg. That's Wait, wait, wait. Nice. Nice. A normal silver shield, not the a magic axe. 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 Its spines axe. bristling, axe. its carapace crunching together, axe. and with a sudden axe. burst of force, roll with spines are launched outward like shrapnel. Attack, defend, ether attack, or nothing. Ether attack. Defend. 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 So, defend. yeah, we'll defend okay. and then we could like, uh, could become weak after we defend and then we eat okay. attack after we defend. We may get a chance to defend. Defend so. is the answer that I hear the most. The figure brings yeah. up the silver shield and craps it behind yeah, it. The projectiles slam into it with great force, each one glanced aside by the mighty artifact. The figure sustains no damage. Hmm? The yes. dream devourer rumbles and opens its mouth. And inside is a light, a burning light which grows one, and then erupts outwards, launching hellfire up sure. into the sky, ready to blanket the area before it in destruction. Attack, defend, ether attack, or nothing. Attack. Okay, so attack or ether attack? Those, I believe those answers are open. I'm not sure if the ether attack is going to be a good thing. I'm not sure if the ether attack is going to be a good thing. Okay, guys. Over there, attack. Over there, ether attack. Ether knife into its mark. I want to do an ether attack because. I've never seen attack this attack side, normal, here, normal yeah. attack that side. We know attack. 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 We know We know attack. We attack. We know attack. We know attack. We know know attack. We 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 know it lets out a gargle and the figure leaps back to safety. The dream devourer takes damage. Easy. The dream devourer shifts and groans and begins to close in on itself. Its protective okay. shell shuts, covering its vulnerable areas with impenetrable material. Attack, mm, okay. defend, ether attack, or nothing. Okay, I think we should try ether attack here. Ether attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's try to defend. Let's see if ether attack is good. Let's do it. Now normal attack. Now normal attack. Now normal Alright, yeah, this was a small thing. Safe to defend. Actually, actually, it could work. I think we should hold on to our ether attack. There's an attack. Let's find out what it does. Now we need to do magic. No bullshit. Yeah, it penetrates because magic. The figure draws the ruby dagger and leaps in close, using the artifact to launch an ether attack. A red jet of energy erupts outward, phasing through the protective shell of the dream devourer, yeah. which takes damage. Let's go. Nice. We got him. Burn this Sadly, I think that means that the second Virginia's thing is not because oh. we're not going to be able to Aren't go through the second phase because we don't have something to stagger it. Holy crap. Mm -hmm. Unless... well, we got to defend, so we might be able to block that. Okay, shh, 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 shh. Okay. Shh, 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 shh. Okay. The dream devourer rumbles angrily and opens its mouth, and inside is a light. A burning light which grows and then erupts outward, launching hellfire up into the air, ready to blanket the area before it in destruction. Attack, defend, ether attack, or nothing. Regular attack. Let's do this again. Just attack. Yeah, sometimes attack seems to interrupt this attack, so attack. 
Yeah, I, mean, I hope attack. it doesn't attack. learn. Though. It's about a fart. Okay. It's about a big ass laser no, or something. No, it's, it's raining. I didn't see an attack interrupt the raining hellfire. It didn't land for the first time, so we're gonna put. It worked the first turn. It will work the next turn. Oh crap. It worked the first time. Oh, it's an animal. Uh, I, think, I think defend, but alright. I timed uh, out the first time. Attack. Yeah. I, I mean, Attack it. Yeah, I guess it's anything it's worse. Worse. Damn, it's it's worse. Worse. Attack. attack, yes. It's attack. attack. Mm -hmm. Wait. We need to learn if this thing can Ready build itself. Ready their bayonet and rushes at the dream devourer at an angle, aiming for the glowing opening of the mouth. The attack strikes true as the blade sinks into its gullet. It lets out a gargle ah. and the figure leaps back to safety. The Dream Devourer takes damage. And... My friends... So far, it has been a flawless performance. Woo! But is it this easy? So no way. Far. Round two begins. Round two. Fight. 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 Okay. The Dream Devourer rears back and begins to rumble. It shudders and energy visibly emanates from its massive form, distorting the very air around it. Eat for attack. It is aiming at the figure. Attack, defend, or ether attack. Uh, ether attack. I think you need to defend or ether attack. 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 A laser here. with a laser. Maybe our bullshit but last is more time he's even saying it worked is when he was trying to defend. The devil A. JMOQ have the situation under control. The figure yeah, but draws the ruby dagger, confident, and uses it to launch an ether attack. The red jet of energy erupts outward, but as it connects with the aura surrounding the dream devourer, the ether attack is dispersed. Damn. Oh, nothing shit. happens. No. <sighs> oh, well, okay. That's tried. actually oh, nothing happens. The dream so of the oh, right. opens its we mouth, it and a sound <laughs> comes from it. The air ripples green, and a metaphysical wave of mimetic energy comes tearing toward the figure. Attack, defend, or ether attack. Defend! 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 No! 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 Defend! No! Defend! No! Defend! No! Defend! 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 Ether attack. Well, then we need a regular attack. It's because it's trying to attack. This is a one. We use the ether to cause the defending. What we see is that the ether attack can cause damage and also and also just cancel their attack. So basically, no one does nothing. So we still say. Okay, so. Ether attack. Double A. Yeah, but the ether attack might have limited uses. Ether attack. Well, we don't know. Well, we have to do something here, or else we're dead. Items, my friends, that have limited uses. Are they healing items? I will tell you that. Oh, so we're gonna do this? Holy crap! We'll use the double A. Okay, ether attack then. Ether attack. Let's go, Ryan. Let's go, baby. Is that what the group is? Ryan, baby. Yes. 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 A great double A battery. My friends, listen carefully. To find out what happens, the figure draws the ruby dagger and, facing the mimetic energy wave, launches an ether attack. The mimetic energy passes through the ether unaffected. Oh. And it collides oh, no. with the figure. 
Uh, and they can only feel God. a moment of something strange happening in their mind before they are instantly killed. Oh. Uh, oh, man. Oh, man. Right. We need that. Damn. 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 Neutral. Squid. Neutral. Losing definition. We don't need the iron dagger anymore, right? Yeah. Yeah. Their body so spilling egg. apart Hydra? into smoke. I make shield. That attack needs a The figure's last Decoy. thoughts burn cold in the dark. This isn't how the legend ends. I was so close. I have to find it. I have to become the... The... All that's left is the sound of a slow... Muffled heartbeat, gently fading to silence. It's time to wake up from this nightmare, uh -oh. my friends. Follow me. Yes, we died. What happens if someone did nothing? How are we gonna well, write the other group guys that we just died? Um. Uh, yeah. Hopefully, they did, hopefully they did worse. Hopefully they did worse. here. As we wait for the other group to finish their path, they should be they than less than a minute away. Uh, so if they're still going on, then that means okay. then that means they're doing better. Listen, 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 listen. Listen. How did, how, did it, how, how did it go? I timed that in the middle, so I did not see the ending. How did it go? We died. Uh, it went. It went well. We learned things. It was good. good. We learned so a lot we of don't things. Need, yeah. We don't, Was we don't it need good, Bandana Buddy? Anymore. We can just bring in. Okay. okay. So, so yeah, we don't yeah, need the kettle. We the only time need the time egg. egg, time egg and I shield. knew it. And then whatever can yeah. and we're going to turn into the ruby dagger that is fucking awesome. Healing and whatever can one yeah. we need one. Here's the thing: yeah. ruby daggers yeah. have yeah. nothing yeah. to do with time yeah. nor eggs. Yeah. Yeah. It completely turned into. Yeah. 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 I was expecting yeah. it to yeah. give something to give us Yes. The only thing that one stops us. I thought it would give us time stop ability, but. Now we need wouldn't to find what else is going to We can block anything. If and you guys wouldn't okay. mind me theorizing, so, do you think that means that, means that we could take an axe instead of a regular so dagger and use that as our attack Roger. item Alrighty, instead and take no, a replace that slot with a new thing? We're very close. A little bit. They're bad. A little bit. I think we were doing good with the bayonet and the ruby dagger because the bayonet was able to stop them from doing magic attacks. Alright, so... Oh, we need static. Something that static is in order to stop in the middle. How did it go? Yeah, it's like a shield. It's a penis promise. It's a penis promise. Last time. No, it's not in my inventory. It's a penis promise. not promise. The penis is remembered, you know what I mean? How did your girl feel? I went bad. My friends. So we should have gotten the holy seal. My or friend. Good luck, son, I, I Your attention, I please. Oh, attention, log charm randomly turns Everybody into attention. a giant shiny shield. Everybody, attention, the omnipotent being is fucking. Thanks, Navi. Yeah, what they said. My friends. <laughs> welcome back. The grand finale awaits. Listen carefully. The daughter opens her eyes slowly. The nightmare has left her head heavy and her mind in a fog. She hangs sideways in the passenger seat, suspended by the belt. She calls for her mother and struggles to unbuckle herself, but freezes when she sees the nightmare come true in the sky. Far above where the wrecked Magenta Mech lies, the black clouds part 
and the dark monument airship shows itself. Its monstrous form grows like a void swallowing the world. Bolts of fire begin to drop everywhere, filling the sky with red. The daughter, unable to free herself, wishes none of this ever happened. She wishes her whole life was just a bad dream. She wishes she was safe with her mother. She shuts her eyes and wishes for a place no monsters could ever find. The Magenta Mech vanishes in the flames. My friends, please use the cold save point. Here we go again. Neutral ending again. Well, I guess it's more like here we are again. Man. Fucking neutral, more like bad ending. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I, I do remember the previous times I was on the neutral ending, the leg was still attached, but now it's not. So that's a definite change. So how bad it was. Oh, it's in the day. I'm going up here. Man, we're gonna, we have an entire week before we can do this again. I'll become its new leg. Oh man. An entire two weeks. They do the agent next week. Oh, yeah. So it's another. Alright. My friends. The story concludes. Another worldly tree sits bathed under shifting blue light. The girl opens her eyes and is finally not met with fire, but complete silence. She manages to unbuckle her seatbelt and crawls over to the pilot seat. Mama, she speaks meekly. Mama, wake up. The little girl crawls into her mother's lap and holds her limp body tight. But there's no response. Mama. M Mama, wake up. Mama. Mama. Yeah. She weeps for an answer. But no one would hear her cries. Not here. Beneath this ocean distortion. Not ever. Welcome to the neutral ending of the pilot. Yep, neutral ending. What the fuck? No. Oh, we're in the neutral ending. Mm. How do you get the bad ending? Uh, good question. By having started uncovering the way to the good one. Yeah. We made it. 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 Okay, so. Did you get it? Yeah, man. Yeah, it was a good try. It was a good try. We did it. Everyone tried different things. And there was comments. It's not because we might need to get it into the next game. Nova Senpai, hug me. I think it's. Oh, my God. We can just.
just stay with the easier one. For sure. We still go to the fight when you put one thing in. I don't agree with I don't agree with I don't agree with the iron pedal. It's a very strong weapon at the end. It's familiar, so I took more skill with it, but it's still just a fucking bayonet. Worst, worst. Good luck trying to turn into a like a silver shining strong shield. Yeah, that's what we need. Uh, the the pilot shield turned into a normal fucking silver shield. We brought a dream tank, but because it was dream related, it turned into fucking dust. Because you can't if you dream dream items to a dream. Or a nightmare in this case, it's worth it. I'm only in the HM looks trying to flip this up and put it over. So we should bring the time tank again because either attacks are needed. Yeah, then we bring the <laughs> the fucking good luck charm. It's a better shield, and then oh, the third like item is so much. Um, whatever we decide next time. Oh, that's 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 my friend, my friend, your yeah, attention, so please, me. Okay. dearest travelers. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. The final time that I will ask for your observance is now. Is that, is that and then you will be free. Game, or is that from a different Kindly game? listen carefully. That's the end Don't worry. Okay. My okay. friends. At this time, yeah, don't worry, yeah, no. please put your hands together for the wonderful like performance of, of, of the Dior. NPCs tonight, you know, it's, it's Geo it's not as... and Luna. Luna was more cool though, like, but he's you were you were more funny. I like the mixture. My friends, we have a celebrity among us. There, wandering oh, about wow. behind you is Iman Nick, the creator of this world in VR chat, famous creator of many worlds. Like everyone who started, like, are my friends. He's over here. Oh, over here. Oh, crowds, 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 crowds. We all love you. Amazing work as always. for creating such a great world. We all love you. Drills in the sky. Nice job. Crowds, 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 crowds. Here, have a Charmander. My friend, oh, thank you. Way. Get him come back, please. Thank you. Oh, you get, get, $20. get your oh, ass is over here. Okay. Come back, oh. people. Okay. You'll have the time. To My go. friends, I'm gonna listen to you right now again. Okay. Mm -hmm. We oh, are VR travelers. travelers. We create immersive story-based tours with original writing, beautiful worlds, voice acting, and wholesome team efforts. We do this for fun. We do this for free. However, we do ask one thing in return. All of you, please join our growing Discord community and post your photos and or comments from today's tour there. Growing Discord. In this community, you can discuss the alternate endings to the, the sleeper awakes. Our headquarters and everything else weird going on that everyone's trying to solve. The Discord server ID is my status in VR chat. Finally, my friends, if you really enjoy the work our team puts into this and you want to help us write more stories and create more beautiful worlds, please support us on Patreon. Our Patreon is only $3 per month. Our tours will always be free, but our Patreon will allow us to create more of this where you spend your time with your friends here on Saturday nights. It's less than what you would pay for a game for an entire year. The information on our Patreon is located in our Discord in the info section, and joining grants you access to play NPCs in our tours, access to many other perks that I could go on and on about. Well, my friends, if anyone needs help joining the Discord, let us know. And now, the floor is yours. Group photo, everybody! I want to be on your hand in the group photo. What color points is the color of your couches? Where shall we do the group photo? Here or somewhere else? Everybody in front of the Mac. Everybody in front of the Mac, please. Okay. Yeah. Second party's on the back, yeah. Oh my goodness.
Hopefully the person who's taking the photo can see everyone's avatar. Well, fuck it. I just want to take a picture of my friend. I'm I wish the camera We're definitely not a we love the Z. We love the Z. Thank you, baby. Cool stuff. Thank you. Next time. Oh, Zena, I know of his Zena Chronicles. So this group photo. Yes! Okay. Ooh, Ooh, hooray! Yeah. So cool. Oh, next week. Yeah, oh, that's, that's right. it. This is what okay. the photo. Oh, yeah, that's what Everyone. I meant to. Like, um, around. Yeah, that one. I remember. Around. I know that was a true. Pro tip, which you are responsible for. Let's take a group photo. <laughs> Pro tip, if you are taking a group photo, make sure you can see everyone's avatar. There's so much heartbreak in it. Eternity? It's epic. All right, everyone, on the count of three, let's all say Mother's Day. Oh, we could do this. Oh, yeah.